Hello everyone and thanks for watching today's video. Those of you who have been following my channel might remember that in the past um, couple of videos I was talking about a few medical problems in which our food pipe or the esophagus gets either very lazy or it is quite tight and narrow and foods don't go down easily. Today I'm going to briefly talk about a few ty different types of foods which are far more difficult to swallow as compared to other foods. So the first thing is bread, especially soft bread or white bread. Um, because when we eat bread, when it comes in touch with our saliva, it becomes very doughy. So anything which become doughy, like cake, croissant, um, etc. or very soft bread, they will tend to get stuck. If you want to eat bread, the best bread to eat is either toasted bread because if you toast the bread, the toast tends to crumble or a very crusty bread which tends to crumble. So try and avoid soft bread and things like very moist cakes and croissants. Second thing to avoid is uh, nuts and especially if you don't chew our nuts very well because nuts form clumps and clumps tend to get stuck. So try and avoid nuts. Uh, anything like peanuts, uh, almonds, uh, uh, cashew nuts, etc. They are far more difficult to swallow. So the next thing to avoid is white meat. So anything like chicken, turkey, uh, ham, also very meaty fish like tuna, they tend to get stuck much easier as compared to red meat. If you're having red meat, make sure there's lots of sauce or gravy on it. So it's not very, very dry. And also when you're cutting the meat, Make sure, please do not cut it along the length of the fibers, cut it across the fibers. So the pieces are very, very small. Or maybe even try mincemeat, which will go down much easier. Because as we know, that long hair block the drain much easier as compared to short hair. So in essence, red meat is preferable over white meat. Lots of sauce or gravy on it, so it's not very, very dry. Next thing to avoid is too much starch in our food. Like when we are having rice or pasta, wash away the starch. So it's not very sticky, it's a bit fluffy. Also, if you're having rice, avoid risotto rice because risotto rice is very uh, sticky, whereas basmati rice is much, much easier to eat and swallow because it's a bit fluffy. So avoid too much starch in rice or pasta. Now what to do if something does get stuck in our food pipe or our esophagus? In my view, the best thing to do is perhaps not to drink water to try and push it down or even tea or coffee to push it down. You must drink something fizzy, anything like fizzy water, Coca-Cola, 7-Up, because the fizz breaks the food down like a drain opener and pushes it down. So I do hope this uh, video did help you or someone you know who have problem with difficulty in swallowing. If it did, then please give us the thumbs up and subscribe and I hope to see you very soon. Take care.